newly public recordings of a very young president making a decision whether to reach for the moon, literally. John F. Kennedy, the new tapes from John Donvan. We have a liftoff. That moonshot in 1969, it was the perfect match of action to words. The eagle has landed. Those words up there. That's one small step for man. And years earlier, these down here. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things. Not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Which were somewhere between a promise and a prediction. Of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the earth. Because we now know we did it. And even if he didn't live to see that, he got to see it started. Sending an uncomplicated message about who we are, that we do what we say we'll do. So surely, JFK himself never worried out loud that a manned landing on the moon was a good idea. Well, listen closely. He did. Do you think the moon and the man landing on the moon is a good idea? Yes. In these latest tapes from the Kennedy Library, it's September 18, 1963. James Webb, head of NASA, is helping Kennedy work through a whole list of misgivings. Why should we send that kind of bill to put a man on the moon? And the fact that after astronaut Scott Cooper went up in May of that year, the launch schedule was really slowing down. If I get re-elected, I'm not, we're not going to go to the moon in my, in our period, are we? And Kennedy worries that the public, despite the early parades, is losing interest and needs to be reminded that this is also about showing the Russians who like their parades who is militarily stronger. If we go, it does look like it's done and too much money. Doubt? Well, we never saw it. And that countdown to the moon that to Kennedy seems so far in the future and to us now so far in the past, it happened, as promised and predicted. John Donvan, ABC News, Washington.